subscribe to the Rack Farm Academy channel. Um, it's, 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 it's nice to I mean, show you how far our day old has grown or has been. You can see that um, this is the day old that we give you the episode concerning their vaccination. Um, you can see we have actually um, picked it up. We are actually picking up very well that. So that is how it goes. So um, as we gave you in our previous video, the feed we give to our day old, that is the chick starter. So since right from the one, right from the one, we give, we do prepare our own feed called chick starter for our best. So right from that time to camp week, then we switch from chick starter to another feed um, formulation. And that is what today we want to go and uh, we want to talk about it. We want to talk about it. So right from tenth week going, and um, what feed do we give to our, our best? You know, you can't give one single feed right from the one upward to the day um, they will live. No, they will not. So you just switch the feed, yeah, to I mean help them. Give you the maximum production that you want when you start laying. So that is what we are going to talk about it. So just follow us, and we are going to show you. You know, these birds they are in their seventh week. They are in their seventh week. So actually, they are still eating the chick starter feed that we do prepare for our birds. So just follow us up. We are going to talk about it, and then. Um, we are going to learn, we are going to learn, we are going to learn about that thing. So guys, that is how it goes. So, um, there is the weeks, the age or stroke weeks, and then the type of feed that we give to the backs. Just right from the day they enter into our uh, farms, that is the day one to ten week, we give a feed called, a feed type called um, chick starter. And this is a chick starter that um, we have been giving so far for the day old that we give you the episode on the vaccination. And then right from 10th week, we switch, right from 11th week, sorry, we switch to chick grower or grower feed. And so for the grower feed, they will take in from 11th week to 15th week. 11th week to 15th week. So, um, and when the enter 16th week, we switch to um, pre layer. That is the P type pre layer. So from 16th week going, they are about laying. Um, they are about laying. And then, um, right from 16th week, from 16th week, um, we give them the pre layer. So you see X and based on the calculation that you make, if you get 5% of X production, then you switch the feed to layer max, to layer uh, max also, to layer max. So that is how it goes. So right from 5%, then you switch to layer feed. So, um, this is the grower feed formulation. Actually, we have given you the video on uh, check starter. So today we are on check um, grower or grower um, feed. From there, we have also given you layer mass to So from check grower or grower feed, you will come to pre layer. You will come to play later. So today we are grower feed um, formula. So that is how it goes. Here are the ingredients: the maize, soya beans meal, um, wheat bran or rice bran. Um, there is oyster shells, layer mass. That is the concentrate. We do use Merida concentrate, afterburn, and then copy vet. And there is the uh, drug 
um, this is the drag, and we, we add it to the feed in order to prevent coccidiosis and to prevent coccy. So that is how it goes. So maize, we take a quantity of 525, 525, and soya meal. Also, we take 250. And when you remember, uh, these figures, they are different from the check starter. You know, the difference between this on the check starter formulation, soya is more. You have to bring more of protein and then more of meat also. And then you reduce the uh, feed brand. So you can see that here, the feed brand has been increased. So that is where you enter into grower. You use more of feed brand or rice brand. And then shares, the shares to you use 11 kilos. And then layer mass, um, which is 50 kilos. And then aframine, in preparing for one ton, you use four. Is it actually a toxic binder. It really helps. So right from the, the one, to the day you will sell them. Yeah, so Afrobine is, is a very good, I mean, product um, that we normally add to our feed. And then also Copivet is a Meridav, um, is a, a Motivet um, uh, a product that we add to our feed. So that is how it goes. So you have to follow this. Um, if you want to, maybe you are a fan of Bedak Farm channel, um, or maybe you are a fan of chicks, that is how it goes. One of the things that, let me tell you one thing, here, yeah, some farmers do use what we call pre-starter. They use pre-starter for maybe two weeks or three weeks before they switch to chick starter. But what Bedak Farm, um, realize is that um, on our previous um, four years back we do use that press data that we bought from um, we bought from market I don't want to mention any product but um, there is one thing that we always during that time we suffered from you can see that when you give that feed to your best and normally they do pick themselves. You could see some blood, you do pick, they, they normally pick themselves, even if they grown up. Even the time during their time of um, laying, they do pick themselves, all because of that break starter feed that uh, we do normally buy. So, um, um, about two years ago, that we started using the check starter, actually, in fact, we have not, we have not experience such a problem before so that is why we encourage you as uh, as a challenge viewer or a customer to our channel if you follow us you can even come down and witness what we are saying even you can even witness it from our channel and this is the feed that we normally prepare for our best and you can see that from our previous video the production wide we gave onto you and um, you saw it and you can even set it up it is on it and so there is there is the feed that we normally do we switch from here um to this and this time we move this this time we go to this and this is what has been helping Medak farm um Medak farm kempi farm as that farm um so that is what we normally do so as we always say try to subscribe it share and then like our page you can share it to almost everyone that you know who are interested of entering into portrait business or maybe who are already into portrait business so that is how it goes in our next video we are going to talk about three layer feed three layer um, formulation or formula and right from that video we are going to talk about okay from the one that is the first week second week third week fourth week sixth week up to 16 week 
the quantity of feed that we have to give to the birds. Supposedly, if they are thousand birds, the quantity that we have to give unto them. So you just follow us up and we are going to give you more information that will really help your farm um, to the point of where that you want to um, reach. So until we meet, we say goodbye.